the maximum vertical height to which a man can throw a ball is 136 the maximum horizontal distance up to which he can throw the same ball see those st- students who know the formula they would have gone the got the answer now you know, very directly it is 136 into 2 which is 272 but uh, which actually gives the answer directly right so which r max is actually h max times 2 Yeah, so that's that. But let us try to understand the you know the, the the mathematical part of this question. So what is given to us is the maximum vertical height. So we have the maximum vertical height is actually u square sine square theta the whole upon two g. Well, actually the height is u square sine square theta by two g. And when we have height maximum, what we get is Theta should be now ninety, right? Theta should be no, sorry, not part of it. Theta should be now ninety, and therefore what we get is sine square ninety, which is one, and therefore the maximum height is equal to u squared by two g, and the given value here is one thirty six meter, right? So we have u squared upon two g given to be one thirty six meters. Okay, now now let's see what is range. So we have r is equal to right. U square r is equal to u square sine two theta the whole upon g, and the maximum value is obtained when theta is equal to forty five, which is sine two forty five sine ninety, which is actually equal to u square upon g. Right. So what is the maximum horizontal the maximum horizontal distance the maximum horizontal distance has the range which is u square by g. Now. Look at the way I'm modifying this equation. I'll multiply the denominator with two and the num- numerator with two as well. So what do we get? U square by two g. U square by two g, right? Because two by two is one, and the value remains r itself. So I'm just making some small alterations here. So if u square by two g is something, what we get is an r itself here. What is u square by two g? U square by two g is actually the maximum height, right? So what is the value of u square by two g? According to the given question, is one thirty six meters, which means r can be written as one thirty six into two, which is two seventy two meter, right? Now, if you go this formula wise directly, what we get is, um, say for example, height maximum by range maximum is actually u square by two g. The whole upon, whole upon u square by g, which gives you u square by two g times g upon u square. Therefore, h max by r max is equal to one by two, or in other words, two h max is equal to r max. Therefore, the correct option here is two. Seventy-two meters. Straightforward question, right? Okay, so uh, that's what we have for question number one. Moving on to question number two again, which is something based on alpha plus beta. Okay, let's see. Let's see the question. 